Hey guys, the aim of this video is to show you the steps on how to find the cross-sectional area of a pipe. So over here we have the front view of a pipe with its outer layer at 5cm from the distance to the center of the circle and the inner rim is 3cm to the center of the pipe. So how we would find the cross-sectional area, which is the highlighted blue section, is to find the area of the big circle with the 5cm radius and subtract it from the 3cm circle and this difference will give us the area of the highlighted blue part. So let's generate a formula. So we can say that the cross-sectional area of this pipe is pi r squared, which is the area of the big circle. So pi r squared. And we call it this five centimeter radius as radius one. And we subtract it from the smaller circle. So pi r squared two. So this 5 cm is our R1 and this 3 cm is our R2. So now we can factor out the pi. So we have pi times R1 squared minus R2 squared. And this over here is the general formula for the cross-sectional area of a pipe. So now we want to work out this problem. What we do is substitute the radius. So we have pi times R1 squared, which is 5 squared. So we train 5 minus by 3 squared, so 9. And if we simplify this down, we get the area as 16 pi. And with our units as centimeters, it would be centimeters squared. And this over here is your answer.